Hey everyone, welcome back to another tutorial by IT Conflict Computer Repair in Austin, Texas. My name is Eric, and thanks again for watching our videos. Today I will be showing you guys how to upgrade the RAM or remove, replace the RAM on a MacBook Pro A1226. So, let's begin. Tools I'll be using are a standard Phillips screwdriver. Let's see that there first thing you want to do on any laptop before you work on them is remove the battery. And first I want to apologize, the glare on the screen you're seeing is because this computer, I'm sorry, um, is very reflective and it is just bouncing light right off of it and it's just ruining my camera. I couldn't get a decent, uh, I couldn't position it and get it decent enough for you guys to watch so this is the best I could do. Okay, to remove the battery first thing you want to do is move this to the release position and you want to push this up the battery should just pop right out there it is I'm going to put the battery off to the side here now upgrading the RAM on this system or moving replacing the RAM on this system is actually pretty simple and what you want to do is just remove these three screws one two three and these are the three screws that are actually going to get us right where we need to be. So, they're tiny little screws. You don't want to lose them. I'm going to put them aside here. And you want to just go through each screw from the factory. They might be just a little tight, so just don't put too much muscle into it. You know, they're tiny little screws. They're not going to be too difficult. Better thing is just don't lose them. Okay, we have the three screws off. You'll actually feel this panel pop right up. There it is. And there's our RAM. So to remove the RAM, all you want to do is just move these side notches off outwards. The RAM should pop right out. RAM slides out. You want to do that to the same thing to the bottom here. Pull those notches outwards. The RAM should pop right up. There it is. And just go ahead and gently pull it out. Let's see, there it is. And the RAM should come right off. So, we're done. If you had a bad RAM stick or if you wanted to upgrade the RAM on this system, again, this is the MacBook Pro. Uh, model number A for Alpha 1226. You can upgrade the RAM in three easy screws by removing the battery, removing three screws. You're already to the RAM module. Uh, you can remove or replace the RAM and you're done. So let's pretend that we got new RAM already. I'm going to install the RAM. Just line up the RAM with the notch there. Push the RAM down. You'll actually feel it and hear it snap it back in place. You want to do the same thing here with this top Porsche, this top RAM, top slot, I'm sorry. Let's go ahead and put the panel back on. Just slides right into place. What am I doing here? There you go. I had to work it into place there. And I'm going to go ahead and screw the screws back in. Well, at least I'm going to try. These are tiny little screws, so you have to be careful. It doesn't, it doesn't have to be too tight. Just enough to keep it in place, you know. We're not going to hulk it or anything. I think uh, just putting it tight enough is fine. Really, it doesn't require any muscle in it. You don't want to break your cool MacBook or anything like that. This is an older MacBook, but you know, every MacBook's a cool MacBook. Every computer's a cool computer, really. Okay, so screws in just like that. I'm going to put the battery back in it. Battery snaps back into place. We have a full charge. Now, you want to go on to doing the PV, I'm sorry, PR, sorry, PRAM and um, reset, the PRAM reset. What you want to do is go over to Microsoft's knowledge base, look up PRAM reset. It's really simple to do. Anytime you're working with the RAM, you always want to do a PRAM reset. It takes you literally 10 seconds to do it, and um, you will be 
up and ready to go. So if you guys have any comments in if you have any comments, leave them in the comment section of youtube.com forward slash IT conflict. Uh, follow us on Twitter, that's twitter.com forward slash IT conflict. And we're also on Facebook. That's facebook.com forward slash IT conflict. Check out our website for free tutorials and uh, some extra goodies. Download some other stuff we have in there for you guys. That's www.itconflict.com. Again, my name is Eric, and thanks for watching another tutorial. Have a good day.